The Industrial Revolution started because of an engine that literally powered itself. Back in the early 1700s, Britain had an energy crisis. They were running out of wood and needed to switch to coal for making iron. The problem was, the deeper they dug the coal mines, the more they flooded with groundwater. They needed a super powerful pump. So in 1712, a guy named Thomas Newcomen invented the first ever practical steam engine. But forget trains. This thing wasn't a motor. It was a massive pump. It worked by filling a giant piston with steam, then spraying it with cold water. The steam would instantly condense, create a powerful vacuum, and suck a giant lever up, which pumped the water out of the mine. The crazy thing is, Newcomen was building this before the Industrial Revolution had even started. There were no good roads to transport parts, no advanced metals to build with, and no easy way to share new ideas. Everything had to be built right there at the mine, with local materials. So how did they power this massive engine? This is the genius part. They used the worthless, low-grade coal from the very mine they were pumping. The engine cleared the mine so they could get more coal, and it was powered by that same coal. It was a perfect, self-contained loop. It was like the single-celled organism that kick-started our entire modern economy.